Hey TFA fans, Sean here. I am with Matt Kent today, creator extraordinaire. He does it all. Uh, we're gonna ask him a few questions, so let's get started. Uh, Matt, let's start with the obvious stuff. What are you working on right now? Uh, right now I'm working on Exo Man of War. Uh, just wrapped a new issue of Ninjak, and I'm working on a, an event book for a spring called Rapture with Shadow Man. Yes, that means Shadow Man is back. You heard that, right? Pay attention. Uh, okay, so you've done a lot of stuff for comics in general. Like, what are you, what are you really proud of? Um, I mean, I'm, honestly, everything that goes out the door, I'm really proud of. And, uh, and I think that's the beauty of working with Valiant is that um, everything that, goes, that has my name on it that's, that goes out to stores is something I'm just as proud of as, as any of my creator-owned work. So, but, so I'm proud of the Valiant stuff. Uh, I think mind management that I did with Dark Horse is probably the, the thing that I did that I'll be trying to beat the rest of my life. You know, if I died, you know, that'd be the thing I'm known for, and, and that's okay. You know, but I'll, I'm going to okay. spend the next 20, maybe 30 years trying to beat it. So. Okay, yeah, I understand that. And, and honestly, I have all confidence in you that you, that you will, to be honest. So, um, let's see. You know, let's, let's, uh, let's give them some interesting things. What do you think are three things that the public should know about you? The public? Uh, I can juggle. I used to play the violin. And uh, I don't know. I love comics, man. Like that's that's the thing I love most. Okay, you know what? That actually is really big in my opinion, because that you know that means that you know he really loves what he does uh, and puts his heart into his work. So that's important. Uh, I did not know that you could juggle, and you better believe that the next time <laughs> we run into each other, I'm going to ask you to do that. I'll do it. No chainsaws. <laughs> okay. No, okay, no, just simple juggling act. I'll, yeah. I'll take it. Um, let's see. Uh, challenges challenges uh do you find that you have any yeah you know like every every project i i start i try to come up with like a, a weird sort of rule that i have to follow you know like i did a whole graphic novel with no captions just to see if i could do one without captions you know um wow. so every book i try to do something different or come up with something a unique unique way of telling the story you know and uh even if it's just for one issue you know it's finding a different point of view or telling a story from a different character's point of view um, I did that a lot with Ninjak, where I just yeah, I played around with the storytelling and then, and then who's narrating and, and that kind of thing, just to try to uh, mix it up. So I, I think if, I'm not, if you're not a little bit scared when you're working on a project mm -hmm. that it's going to fail, um, then, it's, then it's, you're not trying hard enough, you know? Then it's yeah, I, I absolutely. bored. You know? yeah, absolutely. I agree. Um, you know, let's ask a random question. Let's do pancakes or waffles. <laughs> pancakes, but you have to have syrup. If there's no syrup, I'm out. Okay, that makes sense to me. Wait, people eat pancakes without syrup? Uh, some people do. Or you know what? My wife gives me trouble of how much syrup I put on it. Like, oh, man. They had to be drowned in syrup. <laughs> I don't know about you, but like I thought that was gonna be a random, just you know, funny this question. Is, but now I'm this hungry. Is not, man, this is serious. And like, yeah, I'm always hungry for pancakes, but they always give you too much. So I, I eat half of it, and then I'm like, I don't want to see pancakes again for a while. Yeah, that's exactly what happens. But you know what? That's not random. This Let's, is a serious question. This is, this is, a, this is a whole other interview, man, talking <laughs> about pancakes. Do you have a favorite pancake place? Um, man, I don't know. No, not really. Okay. I think that we should go to the Hot Cake House in Portland. I've never been there. Me neither, yeah. but I hear it's fantastic. You know what? Let's let's try it. We can do a whole taste test pancake thing. I'm holding I'm holding you to this. Okay, no, I'm I'm dead. Is gonna be there. Okay, no, I'm I'm dead serious. <laughs> okay. We're doing the pancake thing. Stay tuned for that coming up later. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Thank you. Awesome, man. Thanks. Appreciate it.